People, after the whole video was finished, I actually realized it's not Skeng who got the tattoo. So I would not encourage you to watch the first part of the video. You can just skip, go to the Vibes Cartel side eye and the Idonia. But if you still want to watch, then watch. Well, well, well. Welcome to Rice TV Entertainment, people. Welcome to this upload, to this update. In this one, we have three quick topics we are going to run through. Number one, Skeng puts another tattoo on him, you know, body basically as it relates to Tamale Sparta, as it relates to Sparta. And this really shows the love and respect he has for Sparta. Now, Serpy calls Vibes Cartel name. Basically, Serpy made a video recently and he was accusing Vibes Cartel of ordering, you know, a beating for a female. Now, I also have the I do on your birthday and, you know, I'm kind of late with it. But, you know, before I get started, regardless, stay tuned. Arise TV, subscribe to the channel, don't be on the wrong panel, hit the icon with the bell. So welcome back. People, we are head straight into the content. Now, dancer artist Kang recently took to his Instagram story where he made a post as it relates to getting new tattoos and so on. People, you can take a look. So the video had no sound when it was posted. But that can't stop you from leaving a comment inside this comment section where you think about that. Because when I saw it, I was like, seriously? People, we know Skeng legit put a tattoo on himself already as a relay to Sparta. I think he was like in his back. But, you know, I'm not very sure. I'm not 100% sure right now. But I'm sure he do it already. You understand? No, the artist put Sparta on one arm and the ratty on the other arm. Well, ratty on one arm, Sparta on the other arm. One yeah, is me, same difference. People, as I've said before, this show you the love skin of Tamale Sparta and the whole Sparta movement. This show you the love him have for the Tamale Sparta stand for. This show you the love him have for. Bro, come on. <laughs> you understand? Skeng is just that violent person in music. So, you know, me feel like him naturally I got us love the energy and the vibe of Tamale Sparta. Because people, look into it. Skeng really dig emo. Really dig the darkness side of music. Really dig the dark side of music. Paranoid side of music. You understand violent side of music. And Tamale Sparta is the legit 100% that. I am used to be that he, he was like a lot of that back then than now, like eight years ago. When he used to make songs and... <laughs> you understand? So people, you know, just tell me what I think all about this inside the comment section box down below. Now people, we're over on the Vibes Cartel side of this update right now. And if you did pay attention to what's going on, especially over on the Politrix watch, you would know that Vibes Cartel was recently featured in one of their videos. Serpy made a video legit saying, you know, Vibes Cartel ordered a beating for a female. Now it is shocking. And, well, some people are going to view it as shocking and then some people are going to view it as, okay, this is Vibes Cartel. But when I heard about the news, I was like, whoa. Because people... Remember, this is a female. If you was a male now and we hear say, you know, Vibes Cartel or the beating for this man or this person or, you understand? I could understand it, but when we see the title of the, you know, the video, it's Gaza Kim, by the way. Anyways, I was paying attention to the title and I was like, whoa, Jono, you understand? Because... Basically, in Serpy's video, Serpy, I say, Webs Cartel is just that person, an artist that surrounds himself with 87s about a bad people who know Serpy ain't named them and all of that. Now, Serpy basically explained in, the, in his video that people who normally get beaten, artists who normally get beaten, are younger artists who would rather get beaten but get a highlight. That's how Serpy basically explained it. So it's like, Vibes Cartel is the best way to get a highlight in music 
them time there and them are for just beer beating usual beating and so, and stuff like that if they misbehave or anything things got a bit specific and gaza kim name car you know gaza kim is actually a female and i can't say i believe in this you understand and i definitely don't want to sound like i come from a place where in which you know my sound like I nah listen to this, I nah believe this. It's like, yo, I nah believe this, I nah disbelieve this. You understand? This is just not my business. Because, you know, that's like, that different, bro. You understand? If it was like a man, they would understand if a YouTuber come and attack, stuff like that. And I would say, yo, yeah, isn't it? Because that's men, bro. You understand? That's men to men. But it was a female. And people, if you want to know anything more specific than that, then I would suggest you go over Serpy's channel and tune into their video. I have a laugh sometimes, Star Jano. It's sad, but that's how it goes. You understand? People, I can't lie, Serpy, I tell. I can't so it go. But you know, considering the songs where Vibes Cartel sing, he's a dancehall artist way in which if I heard that news from anyone, I would not believe it. But that's just me. Leave your thoughts inside the comments area. Inside the comment area. Now people, we're over on the Idonia side of this update right now. And Idonia's birthday party, the whole event itself was a success. A lot of people came out. A lot of influencers came out. A lot of entertainers came out. You know, Intense, Iwata, Javilani, Stylo G, Governor, not to mention Governor Well. Don't have to ask. I don't have a host event. I don't have a birthday party. You know? Governor Kadede. That's Governor and I don't have. You see me? Close relationship. Now, Schemas was also there. <laughs> if you wonder who Schemas is or you hear the name recently but don't know, it's the person on the screen right now. He's a comedian also. His name is Valdemore. And... You know, they, they, they really contribute to making the event a success. Contribute to making the event, you know, festive, nice. You want the day. But definitely like the performances, you know, even though the performances weren't long. Well, of course, they're not long. It's not like it's a show, it's a birthday party. So, so everybody came out, my people, and showed respect and love to Idonia. And looking at it, it was wonderful because it showed you a dance all day. It sure is a dance hall still have love and supporting it because look at it, you are also even your co workers, them, your friends inside music. They are pass through. They make sure they show them face. You know, if someone has a party keeping inside your community, or you would go and show your face and show your support and show your love. So when you are keep a party, them can come show them face and support your thing too. As I that me see I go on inside dance hall. And Considering the dance hall a move go, our people say a move go, that is, you know, a good component. But people, just leave your thoughts inside the comment section as it relates to all of this. What do you think about the individual performances? What do you think about the whole event itself? What do you think about the skin? And also, the vibes cartel we talked about. I appreciate the love, I appreciate the support. You know, people just keep supporting Rice TV. We're on our way to 80,000 subscribers right now. And you know, we can't wait for it. So definitely just hit that subscribe button and contribute to us reaching or getting to that milestone. You understand? Stay blessed and definitely stay tuned for more on our channel.